Okay, well, we're back. And I just ran around the corner of this building to try to hide herself and just get her composure here for a minute because she completely freaked herself out. She did not think that she was going to do that. And then when she saw the circumstances of the orphanage and the way that the kids were being treated and what Constance said about the situation, and she didn't really know what she was thinking it's just like she sudden she suddenly acted and she didn't even realize what she was doing until it was all over and she totally just freaked herself out Whew. we did not come here with the intention to murder an old woman but unfortunately that is exactly what we have done okay all right and i just play it cool nobody's come out of the orphanage yet that we can see so i don't think the guards know that what's happened so let's just uh, let's just play casual. We'll get to the gate and we'll make our escape. Does that sound good? Good grief. Hope she doesn't make a habit of murdering people without realizing what the hell she's doing. God. Okay, there's a guard. Just play it cool. The guards don't know about it yet. Nobody's reported it. Be cool. Be cool. Be cool. Be cool. The guard is looking at you. Okay, the guard's turning around and walking away. You're good. Okay, that guard's looking at you, but not suspiciously. Maybe a little bit suspicious. Okay, maybe just speed up a little bit. Let's just go a little bit faster. Uh, uh. Okay, there's a guard there. Don't, don't, just kind of, just, okay, let's just do, 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 do. <laughs> oh, boy. Uh. Okay, we made it out of the town. Hmm. Just, um, hmm. Maybe we should think about getting a horse, do you think? Let's see, is there somebody here we can talk to about that? Oh, you know what? We don't even have enough money for a horse, Anag. Oh, wait. It's this guy. We helped him. Any luck with Sapphire? Yeah, I took care of it. By the eight? You actually talked her into it? Mm hmm. I don't know what to say. I didn't think anyone in Riften even cared what happened to me. Look, I was saving this, but I wanted you to have it. I thought I might need it if Sapphire came for me, but I don't need it anymore. Invisibility potion. Well, that doesn't really get us the money to buy a horse. Speed our way out of here, but it's something. Okay. Alright, and I, we are officially on the run. So let's make a very quick decision here. We have never been closer to the border of Morrowind. And that is when you first set out from High Rock, what you were hoping to be able to do was get to Morrowind. You figured that was the safest place you could be, farthest place from your home, the least, last place that anybody would be looking for you. But since then, you have heard from the Dunmer in Skyrim that Morrowind is nearly, if not entirely, inhospitable to life. So you're kind of turned off the idea of going there. It just seems... too much of an unknown at this point. It seems like maybe it's not less dangerous than Skyrim, which is what you'd really hope to achieve. So maybe for now what we should do... I know it's just so tantalizingly close, it's right there. What we, should do, what we should do is we did tell the Artino boy we'd be back in Windhelm within a week so we do need to go back there and say something to him we wouldn't just abandon him to his lot we need to tell him what happened the crazy thing that we did without even realizing we were doing it and then we will figure out what we can do with ourselves here in Skyrim hiding out 
just some place where you can lay low, some place where there's not a lot of people, some place where nobody ever goes, some place where it's kind of a backwater, like Farron sort of is within High Rock, some place where you're not going to be noticed and nobody's going to care that you're a stranger. Right? Right. Let's get the hell out of here. Whew. What a turn of events that was. And I just murdered an old woman in cold blood. Because of what she heard the woman was doing to those kids. I mentioned to you guys that Anag does have a soft spot for kids. She doesn't like hearing of kids being mistreated. I think that's probably what turned it for her, was, you know, she was going into it, she was thinking, this woman runs an orphanage, she takes care of kids, why would I be doing anything violent to her? And then as she got to, oh right, this is bandits, we should probably go around. And then as she um, learned more from the kids, from Constance, and from Grelet herself, frankly, um, she realized that the kids were better off being homeless. And what's the point of an orphanage if you're not going to allow the kids to be adopted? That's the whole point. The whole purpose of an orphanage is to house the children until a caretaker comes along who can provide for them. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Oh, it's coming straight for us. Okay. Um, let's double cast Firebolt for now. Run, run, run. Let's see, where is Oak Flesh? Oh my god! Mike doesn't even have time to think about the murder that she just committed. <laughs> She's got to fight a dragon. Right, let's get this ready. I'm assuming he's going to respawn. Maybe? Maybe not. Hmm? Hmm. I'm not going to take the venison because we don't know how long that thing's been sitting there, but... Apparently the dragon is not coming by. It's rather strange. Oh yeah, the bandits. <laughs> hmm? Where are you running to? Oh crap, is it over here now? <gasps> Shit. Of course we couldn't be so lucky. fight it near other people. Yeah, I'm with you, Filnar. Filnar, whatever your name is. Where did he go? There he is. Is he coming? Or is he just is he just challenging like the uh Windhelm dragon was? Oh shit, he's attacking Shore Stone. Maybe, maybe not. You damn dragon, come on. Shit or get off the pot. Oh, 
missed. We're gonna have to fight it with the bandits. Oh crap. Whoa! Oh, Niagara, you alive? Get up, girl, get up! Oh my god, she went flying! Oh, the poor girl. I don't know how she survived that, but she did somehow. Let's get back to it. No, 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 you stupid bandit! Ugh. You asshole. <laughs> oh, you fuckers. Ugh. Whoa! At least we got off that fire. Oh, Jesus. He's freezing me. No! Hmm. Okay, so it's actually kind of handy that he throws us halfway across the field. Because it gets you away from the dragon. use up all of our magic of potions on a dragon. I missed! Shot it right over his head. Hmm. No, not sure stone! Epic music. chasing this thing all over the place. Run, 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 run. Hey, he's he's taking a lot of damage actually. This is good. Okay. Right. Um Oh shit. Round the back, round the back, round the back. Whew. More. Yes. He's down. Get him. Oh, he's almost dead. Killed him. We did it. And that didn't take three videos. Ah. 162 gold. I wonder if this will over encumber me. Yep. Damn it. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Got a lot of firewood, but I'm afraid I'm going to use it on the road. That's why I haven't give, gotten rid of it. Let's eat some apples. Not 32. Oh, I don't want to store any apples. I want to... Hmm. Hmm. We don't need that, because it's part of our um, tent now. Hmm. Hmm, let's eat that. Oh, I didn't eat it. I took. I gave it to the dragon. Right. Sorry. Okay. Anyway. Damage stamina. I think I know all these other ones because I already had them on me. Oh, small antlers. I just ate antlers. Weakness to poison. Still carrying too much. Okay, so we have to drop something. Something serious here. I could just drop that. That's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Ooh. It kinda sucks because it's actually worth quite a bit. But I'm gonna drop it. It's really dead then? Appears so. Well, 
You guys have redeemed yourselves. Dead, then? You didn't kill the spiders, but you killed the dragon, and that's just as impressive. In my years, I've never seen such a thing. Well done, Anag. That was pretty awesome. What time have we got? Dinner time. We should probably look for a place to camp out. Okay, let's eat really quick. This will be an on-the-road kind of meal. Um, okay. Moving on. Wow, dragon fight. Holy cow. So anyway, as I was saying, uh, Nag did not go into Riften thinking she was going to kill Grella. It was only after she saw the reality of the situation and she realized, you know what? This bitch has got to die. These kids deserve better than this. If they're not even going to be adopted, then we have a serious problem on our hands. I wonder if we're going to have a better spot to camp than that tower. Nah, yeah, let's keep going. We'll just camp when nightfall hits. It's getting really foggy. Holy moly. What are you, a wolf? I don't want to deal with wolves. No, you're a sh uh, deer. Elk, something. I could activate you, I'm so close. Hmm. More a tapanella. Okay, we are approaching East March. That's the uh, path up to Northwind Summit, which we already saw. Could camp out in there. We know that it's clear, but no. What time is it? It's not even 7 yet. Ugh, what a day. Murder, dragon, <laughs> on the run. Well, if nothing else, this at least at least gets rid of I think we want to go this way. At least gets rid of the Dark Brotherhood threat, right? Oh shit. Oh, damn it. Whoops. Didn't want to miss. Shouldn't have missed. Yep, we're dead. Wolves are posing a real problem for me since I installed Skyree. It is quite the challenge. Let's switch to uh, Lightning Bolt. That seems pretty badass. Yeah. Take this, wolves. Whoops. I need to quit missing that first spell, is what I'm going to do. Ugh, okay. More potions, less spell missing. 